What's up guys, welcome back to the vlog. So today I'll be working here at a beer house and before I start my shift, I think I need to get some coffee. So, coffee first. So, I've been here in Singapore for a week now and yeah, <laughs> 2024. I'm kind of lost, you know, um, yeah, never really, I haven't really got the urge to make more content. I've been doing a lot of research, yes, but at the same time, I'm not going out that often. Um, just, you know, meeting up old friends, meeting up, you know, not, I wouldn't say clients, meeting up like business partner, like old business partner, just having a talk, having a chat. For the whole week and yeah that's what i've been doing the whole week and i realized you know i need to make some a little bit like more income on the side so yeah just started working part-time so i want to take the time like i want to take this vlog to tell you guys more about you know why i have moved to singapore and like, you know what's going on back home and all that stuff so yeah at the same time i'll be showing you guys like the workplace of my new workplace, my new part-time place um, and yeah, I'll be sharing you guys more information on yeah, what's going with me, what's going on with me. Hello, one coffee please. Alright, so Long story short, I spent my 2023 back in Myanmar and yeah, I started a business, I started my YouTube channel for good and yeah, things are going really well for the first four to six months and then things started to, you know, yeah, basically uh, what happened was the political, you know, the country is not stable, so everything is not good for now, um, you know, I can just stay there and stuck around like you know for the the whole of 2024 or 2025 but yeah i can't wait um any longer because i don't know when the situation is going to be settled and yeah basically i needed more money um what i'm making in myanmar what i'm making from youtube is not enough for me my personal lifestyle whatever that i have you know planted uh throughout my years so yeah that's why i came back to singapore you know for I don't know I don't know how long I'm gonna be here but for now as of right now I'm gonna be based here in Singapore probably gonna be traveling a lot it's so much easier for me to you know travel from Singapore to other countries um, yeah so that is it and right now it's gonna be five I need to wear my watch and then I need to get to work you want to do TikTok you sure <laughs> you don't have you know you want I will shoot for you. This is the pizza chef. <laughs> this is the, the master here. Rinaldo! <laughs> Alright. Okay, I'll try to introduce you guys like to everyone. Nice. Okay, there's like a handsome man coming over right now. Handsome man with full sleeve. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Alright, so this is gonna be my work area, pouring beers, craft beers, and yeah, making cocktails out of those. So it's been one hour at, my, at this workplace and it's like pretty chill, it's only one table for now. These are some weird design for craft beer. I can't understand this one, you know, showing the culture of Vietnam. But these, these. So, how much do I earn working here? It's about uh, $15 times six is like around $90 for six hours. So that's a pretty good deal. I think that is like my one week salary back in Myanmar. 
So, yeah, I think it's gonna, this is the case where, you know, those like uh, poor countries in Southeast Asia, like Myanmar, Philippines, I don't know, like maybe Bangladesh, people who come here to work here, they are really, really, you know, hustling for like uh, a few years and then they just pack up and then go back home, start a new business and stuff like that. But yeah, I mean, I've always, you know, thought about going back to Myanmar and yeah, do my own things. But yeah, like I said, right now it's just not a good time. Uh, and if I were to work full time, I'll be earning like triple or quadruple the amount that I'm earning right now. But yeah, I'm still thinking if I should try full time or just, you know, do some part time and then yeah, get some income and more and focus more on YouTube itself. But yeah, still in the deciding process. Chicken rice by Chef Z, right? No. <laughs> oh my god, that looks good. This is for the staff meal. Thanks, Chef. It's good, man. And it's probably good. The rest of the stuff are eating it is like crazy. Right. So basically, this restaurant, the this, this beer house, they do like incredible pizza, um, like Western food as well, and 20 craft beer, which is crazy. So in the next video, I'll be you know coming down here in the afternoon, maybe like late evening, to review some of their beers and some of their food as well. So yeah, excited for that day. But yeah, today I'm working and. It is, to be honest, pretty boring today. It's like Wednesday and there's not much people. So I'm just standing around talking to the people around here. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. Some, some customers, they pretend to need to the beer. They know the beer? Some. But we keep changing it, right? Or is, is it always, always the, the same one? Saturday, right? You're, there's an event. I, will, I might come down. Seven bridges. Now. Seven bridges, yes. I don't know what bridge that's a money for me. Okay, so let me just vlog a little more before I, you know, get inside the gym. Anyway, after making that decision to coming back to Singapore, it was, you know, like a 50 50. It was good and bad at the same time. To be honest, I haven't been, I haven't been feeling myself lately when I wake up like you know I don't want to do anything when I go to bed like you know the whole day is just it's just um yeah this is it just feel weird it just feel like you know I'm not in the mood to vlog which is I wish I love to do and which has been going well for me uh, for the past year when I was like vlogging like crazy but yeah I need to find myself in that rhythm again uh, maybe because I'm a little bit stressed out, you know, I make the decision to go back and start off something 
and right now it feels like um, you know I'm giving up uh, which I'm not to be honest uh, it's just that it's really hard for me I don't want to work for someone else and when my business is failing failing and yeah I don't have like the enough income I couldn't pay for my saving plans I couldn't pay for my insurance and the YouTube money is not enough for me to sustain it all so yeah I don't have um, I don't have a choice but to come back here even if I'm working part-time if I work for like you know 10 days and uh, I'll be able to you know pay the bills and stuff like that so yeah Singapore is, is just different uh, if you have a, a good skill set of any kind you can pretty much earn quite a lot of money so yeah but yeah um, haven't been feeling myself lately I need to get back to where I am and where I ended off in 2023 so yeah this vlog basically yeah it's just a reminder for myself and yeah letting you guys know like how I'm feeling and all that stuff so yeah but I'll be back um, I might be joining a full time where I'm where it is more flexible for me to do YouTube as well so yeah but it's gonna be on and off I'm gonna be traveling out like I said early, earlier on from Singapore so it's gonna be an exciting year of 2024 here on the YouTube here on my channel hopefully I'm, I'll be able to travel a lot more and vlog a lot more and tell a lot better stories and stuff like that hopefully I can grow within this year as well but yeah right now it's, it's just like that so I'm trying to build myself back again I don't want to feel like you know I given I have given up on this dream of mine um, being self-employed doing YouTube entertaining people and all that good stuff all the things that I love so yeah I'll be back guys and yeah hopefully my country is in a much more stable situation so that I can get back and do the business that I want to um, I'm not saying that you know um, working in Myanmar is bad bad it's just you know I have a different lifestyle and yeah I want to maintain that lifestyle and I want to you know hit my target you know financial goals so yeah and I'm back in Singapore to hit those uh, at the same time you know hit my you know craft beer goals uh, craft beer company and YouTube yeah I've got I, just, I think maybe I'm just too greedy I just have a lot of things on my plate but anyway I'm gonna do them all I'm gonna achieve them all no matter how long it takes me so yeah that is it guys uh, I've been disappearing from YouTube for a while like I've been like on and off so yeah that this is the reason why hopefully I can get back up from this and yeah start vlogging daily and yeah give you guys more content and you know share about life in general here in Singapore and here in around Southeast Asia for sure so yeah thank you guys so much for watching thank you for all the support and uh, yeah just a few of you who are you know always watching my videos commenting and giving me more support thank you you know who you are I think I don't have to mention the name here but yeah thank you guys um, I appreciate every single one of you um, I'll see you guys in the next vlog time to hit the gym bye